want to be shut up. Oh my god. Get Ali you won't believe this. Alicia just broke up with Jerry. Oh. It was mutual. Uh, hey. Hello, folks. My name is Johnny Robinson, and this is Charlie Mayette. I'm Johnny Robinson, and he's Charlie Mayette. Anyway, um, this is the After Midnight News at 11 on Channel 4 at 14. Wait, four, four. <laughs> Do you ever get the feeling that you're being watched? It's 2000 today. And I learned how to spell 10 plus the 2000 millennium T times R N U. Oh, whoops. Oh. Well, in Wisconsin today. Anyway, today in Wisconsin, a man sued everybody in the world because they all said, oh, it's impossible to lick your elbow. He, but he did. And um, so he's probably going to be a brillionaire. Everybody has to pay him one dollar. Indeed. Uh, top story today, an earthquake occurred. And Johnny uh, went down there this morning to uh, add details and report on it. So uh, let's go to that footage now. Johnny Robinson, and this is not a microphone, it is a piece of wood. Anyway, um, this is the earthquake that we were talking about, and we've created a dramatization of how this actually happened. Marge! 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 No, not me! The, the building! Stop! Marge! 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 So now if you uh, follow me in here, I'll show you around the place. Uh, quite a nice place before it got wrecked. It's still a pretty nice place. Um, you have things such as uh, this. Um, hey, a paint can. I could probably use this, actually. I'm going to keep this. Uh, they have a chair. Hmm, might be good. I should probably come back for that later. Uh, so, yeah, you know, you can tell it's really great and wrecked. I love it. Well, that, that was interesting footage, I must say. Thanks. Uh, now we're going to move on to our special guest, uh, Chef Mozzarella. He's uh, going to show us some healthy alternatives to everyday foods that we eat. And uh, hopefully we can only lose a little weight and make America have a better name. And I know, like, obesity. Terrible. Yeah. Let's have him on on the uh, upstairs studio kitchen. Hi, Chef Mozzarella here. And I'm going to tell you about some healthy alternatives to everyday food. Maybe you're eating a burrito, you know, from Taco Bell. Why not have some cornbread instead? Eating a cookie? Enjoying that cookie? Enjoy some cornbread. Maybe you're having, uh, I don't know, maybe you're having some chocolate ice cream and fattening up your stomach. Why don't you fatten up your stomach with some cornbread? Now we're going to move on to our second segment, veggies. So if you're... Why'd you change the cameras on me? So if you're eating a nice healthy vegetable like tomatoes, why not replace that with some full calorie, full sugar Oreos? Because they taste better. So these are the three most unhealthy drinks you can ever have in America. You get full sugar Tropicana orange juice, some soft soap lemon scented, and some lemon lime Capri Suns. Now I have some healthy alternatives to make this a, a way healthier way to drink. So if you're enjoying some Tropicana full sugar orange juice, why not replace that with some barbecue sauce? It'll, uh, it'll add your, a little bit of taste to your throat. Now if you're having some soft soap lemon scented, why not replace that with some sour cream? Reduce fat. Reduce fat. Think about that. That rhymes. Continuing on, if you're having some lemon lime Capri Sun, why not replace that with some feta cheese? Cheese up the joint, if that makes sense. Now, thank you for your time, and uh, let's cut back to the newscast. Don't act like you're a part of us, Chef. Anyway, I'll have to check out those alternatives when I get home. Yeah, we will. Um, yes. Yeah, we'll uh, do that. This just in. Um, my uncle is named Jeff. He's just an interesting guy. Jeff Foxworthy is. I, I think I've said that before. So. Yeah, but no one's ever seen that, so no, it's it, pointless to okay. bring it up. Anyways. Um, no one knows what we're talking about right now. But now we'll cut to Charlie with something random. Yay! 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 In Russia, the most popular name used to be Frindle. Now it's Doorknob. Receiving updates.
Now it's DVD player. Now it's dog's tail. Now it's tripod. Now it's magnetism. How interesting. Now we're going to cut to our five minute commercial break. Uh, see you after. Pretzels will change your life. This is your life before eating pretzels. This is your life after eating pretzels. So buy Jimmy Dean's RibbQ sandwiches. They go for $3 a pound because they're terrible. and we're back. Um, another top story today. I've been here the whole time. You probably were wondering where I was. Uh, so I'm right here. All right. Another top story today. Miley Cyrus was caught breaking into a local convenience store. Many questioned her, why did you do such a thing when you already were a millionaire? She responded in the following way. So I put my hands up. They're playing my song. And the butterflies fly away. Not in my head like, yeah, moving my hips like, yeah, and I got my hands up. They're playing my song. I know I'm gonna be okay. Yeah, it's a party in the USA. Yeah, it's a party in the USA. I, I, what, I wonder what that means. Not sure. Uh, I know she's had a lot of song hits, but that doesn't seem like any of them. So. Right. Well, we got to our next top story, uh, we're gonna go over to Joni. Well, Johnny's stuck at Roach Brothers. All these aisles look the same. So we're gonna just go to me with the news. A new invention has been created by the Yankee Candle Company that actually makes candles that give you numerous insults when you light them. Let me show you an example of this. Hey, Baldy, when do you lose your hair? Zoink! Your mom is so fat that when she stepped on the scale, it's said to be continued. Zoink! That last joke wasn't very funny, was it? Zoink! Technology has really gotten far nowadays. And now that Johnny's back, we'll go to him. Folks, I've just discovered I'm the best piano player to ever grace this earth. <laughs> And household flies are now becoming more prone to peanut allergies. Thanks. It's a real shame. Yeah. If you know about the Shut up. fact. Uh, anyway, another top story. Africa. It's what are we gonna do with it? I mean, I mean, we've already used it for land farming and cheese milking. And, oh. Well. Anyway, Charlie has something to say. So. Um, folks, I I want to thank you all for watching. And to close out, I'm gonna yell at myself while Johnny discovers the secret gnomes of silence, also known as my closet. Yes! You can do better than that! Come on! Bring yourself into the world of winning! If you want to win this cross game, you gotta get in there and grab boxes and see the whitey sighties! Whitey sighties! What in the world is that? Anyway, whitey sighties on the Tuesdays and Wednesdays! Ah, you gotta be kidding me! And now back to the prize winning documentary. Ted Nugent called, he wants his pants back. Pants back. Pants back. Pants back. Pants back.